all my bells and welcome back welcome back to the channel y'all welcome back to the channel yeah i'm about to start eating already because i'm hungry y'all i'm starving i'm starving but if you are new here welcome and if also if you're new here go ahead and hit that subscribe button so that you can become part of my little family my little family because it's little y'all but i don't care that it's little it, it don't matter to me my little family y'all already saw the title y'all see what i got i got me some in and out animal fries and i got an animal style cheeseburger protein style i was like if i'm gonna get the fries i'm not gonna get the bread guess what y'all i went to the gym today i just got back from the gym y'all i was like i need to go to the gym i can't be around here wobbling because i'm sitting up eating food all day long and then going to sleep so i went to the gym today y'all yes i did and i'm excited about it yes i am y'all so i got me some I just told y'all what I got. My mouth is watering because I'm really hungry. Y'all y'all know what? They didn't give me a fork. I got one right here, but they didn't give me that dog on fork. How they thought I was going to eat these with my hands? So these are the animal style fries at in and out They look kind of pitiful. They don't look that pretty to me. But those are animal style fries. And then I got an animal style, protein style cheeseburger. And I got a pink lemonade. Pink lemonade. And I got some ketchup because, yes, I like ketchup on everything. I'm going to put some ketchup on these. Um, I Actually, I'm going to take them out of this box so y'all can see them. I know y'all be like to see the stuff. And then y'all, they gave me three packs of ketchup. I'm like, what am I supposed to do with three packs of ketchup? I, I'm I want to know. What am I going to do with three packs of ketchup? I, I don't know what they thought I was going to do with it, but I like ketchup. They should have looked at me and said she like ketchup. Let's give her a lot. Yes, I like ketchup. On everything. Everything. So y'all went to the gym. I felt good. I wasn't able to get on as much as I wanted to get on because it was crowded. I, I think that's why I really don't like to go at this time because you can never do what you need to do. Somebody gonna say that's a whole lot of ketchup. Yes, it is. I like it. I like it. So I had to use two McDonald's ketchups because they only gave me three. Because I have to have ketchup on my burger. I, I cannot eat a burger without ketchup. Even though I believe when they do it animal style, it comes with ketchup, I think. I know they put a whole lot of that sauce up in there. A whole lot, a whole lot of. A whole, a whole lot of. Y'all, I'm, I'm starving, it seems like. That's why when you go to the gym, it seems like you burn up your calories. Then you get out and you be starving. That's me. That's me. Yeah, they put a whole lot of that that stuff up in here that um y'all probably say she just said yesterday she don't eat beef no did not say i didn't eat beef i said i will eat a hamburger i just don't buy it at my house get it right y'all know how y'all be trying to drag folks i remember she said she didn't eat beef but she eating the burger i never said that i didn't eat beef i had to clear it up for y'all because y'all know how y'all get and i'm not talking about everybody but there's people out there who be like i heard her on the video say she don't eat beef and then I cleared it up. I said, I don't buy beef at my house, but I will eat a burger from time to time. I buy steak from time to time. I don't even know why I'm explaining this to y'all because I'm grown and I do what I do. Now I'm just playing y'all. Um, but I am grown. I, I am grown. But <laughs> I don't give y'all bite because I'm hungry, y'all. I'm starving. It seems like you got to eat in and out stuff like soon as you get it, like in your car while you're on your way home. In and out is not even five minutes away from me, y'all. Not even five. So I don't understand why this stuff is stuck together like that. Maybe they should use um, nacho cheese so it's not stuck. Because this is just a piece of sliced cheese that they're using. Y'all like in and out but how a lot of people like pump in and out up like it's just banging. It's the bomb. It's okay, but I have to have in and out when I want in and out. Like, I can't just be like, it's an everyday thing. Like, oh, yeah, I'm going in and out. No. I have to really want it to be able to go there. And today, I really wanted it. Well, actually, I don't think I probably really wanted it. It was just free. Y'all know I like free, right? They show up a lot of lettuce up on here. Mmm. Y'all, 
I'm talking to content creators at this time. I think that's all the people I have on my channel is content creators. But this morning I got up and I was not able to, my videos were not able to get comments. And I'm like, why can't people comment? Why are my comments shut off? I didn't do that. So I was trying to figure out why they were cut off. I figured it out, y'all. Because I set my video, it asked me was my videos for kids. My videos are for kids. I don't curse. I don't do nothing that I'm not supposed to be doing. So I put that, but I didn't know that I had to not put that because if it's for kids, then you can't have any comments, I guess, because kids can read the comments or whatever. But I'm like, that's weird. Because my friend was like, um, I wasn't able to comment on your video. And I was like, why? So I go in there and look and none of my videos, all of them had like the comments that people have commented before say zero. Like I had no comments on my channel. I'm like, what's going on with that? So I went in there and I did one. And I took the kid thing off of one. And I'm like, oh, that's what it is. And then I went and I checked my email and it told me that. If you have a set for kids, then they'll cut the comments off. I still don't know how to do my, um, fix my community post back. Because I can't even post on my community post. So help me because I don't know what to do. Y'all, I'm telling y'all, I don't know nothing about nothing. Absolutely nothing about nothing. I just know how to record a video, edit it, and post it. I really don't know how to do much. I ain't going to even sit here and lie and say I know how to do everything because I don't. I'll be lying. So, when it comes to the, I guess you want to say analytics of things, I don't know what I'm doing. So don't. I didn't even know nothing about no emails until I one day I put the um what is it Microsoft or whatever that the Gmail account the one with the M whatever it is it's got an M on it I put that on my phone and then all these emails piled like five hundred so I go and look in there and I'm like oh this is all YouTube stuff I I didn't know I'm still trying to figure out how you to how to email YouTube because I still cannot. Go live, and I got over a thousand subscribers. I can't go live from my phone. I can go from my my laptop, but not from my phone. I wish I had a knife to cut this. I'm not gonna get up and get one. This fork probably gonna break. But so I can't go from my phone. So I'm still trying to see who I need to email. Because why y'all not let me be great? I would actually go live while I'm driving to work. So y'all can come to work with me. Y'all can't go to work with me like get in a train. Y'all can't do that. I'll be fired. But we can drive to work while I'm driving to work and chit chat. Y'all probably say, lady, we ain't going to be up with you at no um, 12 o'clock in the morning. Well, not everybody's from where I'm from. So some people at 12 o'clock, it's like they getting up, getting ready for work because it's like 4 o'clock where they live. Or 3 o'clock where they live. Maybe even the next day. But I would like to go live because I know going live gets your hours up. I feel so close to my hours, but it's taking me a long time to get there, which I'm not rushing it. I'm really not. I work nine to five. I got a J-O-B and I ain't going to go quit my J-O-B because of YouTube. I got health benefits, dental benefits. Vision benefits, and I ain't about to screw those benefits up. I sure ain't. This is messy. I like pickles, but not on burgers. And when you go to in and out and get your um, burger animal style, it involves pickles. 
So and all animal style is, if it's some of you inquiring minds would like to know, animal style in your burger, if you go and you say you want your burger animal style, all it is is they add pickles, because you don't get pickles on the In-N-Out burger, just if you get to the regular way. You get pickles, grilled onions, and I believe they put ketchup on it, if I'm not mistaken. I believe they do. They probably don't. It's probably just all in my head. But I get the, oh, this is too much. It's like, why do they put all this stuff on it? I, I don't know, y'all. Y'all know iceberg lettuce is the wateriest lettuce. So you ain't doing nothing but eating water when people think, oh, if I eat a salad, that iceberg lettuce ain't doing nothing for you. I ain't got no type of nutrients. They probably got a little, but not too much. The greener the veggie, the better it is for you. That's what I heard. <laughs> That's just what I heard, y'all. They gave me two, two, two mini tomatoes. I guess they said she's going protein salad. Let's give her some veggies. She needs them things. Told y'all I'm like uh, these things. They mushy too. But I'm trying to eat them. Because you need to. There was a little hard piece in there. I had to take that out. Mm. What the mess is that? These fries don't say animal style fries, they say animal fries. Is they say animals? Look what the box say. Animal fries. Why, where's the style at? Y'all know what? I be tripping off a lot of places. Like Raising Cane's. It's dogs on the pictures of the place. It's like, why, why is it dogs? As the, the, the logo. I'm gonna have to look into these places and see why they name their places the way what they name them. Because I really don't understand why I got pictures of dogs. There's these little Mexican candies that we used to eat. Um, they were salted plums, but I don't know what they call it in Spanish. But they were supposed to be salted plums. But on the package, it's a dog on it. I'm like, are these dog treats? And we eating them? They was good dog treats, though. Them things is good. But I, I just be, I trip off a lot of stuff, like the Charmin commercial. Why is the bear using toilet paper? Bears don't use tissue. He's like, um, I pick them up because my hiney's clean. I know my hiney's clean. Bears don't use tissue, y'all. I be looking into these commercials, y'all, because sometimes these commercials is a mess. A mess and a half. Like the progressive, is it progressive? With flow, that's progressive, right? Commercials or insurance commercial. And they coming out the cornfield. And the man tells his daughter to get in the house. Why is the insurance agents talking crazy like that? I don't understand it. I don't know. But uh, I analyze a lot of stuff, y'all. I really do. Remember I told y'all uh, for me wearing my retainers and I don't wear them that often? And I've been trying to wear them. My gum back here is cut and it's burning. Everything I put back there, it hurts. I can feel that my gum is cut back there. Like it's having a flesh eating disease. I don't know. Y'all, I'm tired. I really am. Y'all probably say, you just said you don't like those. I told y'all, if they put in my food, I eat it. It's actually good with this um, Thousand Island, because that's all it is. They try to act like they're making something special. It's ketchup, mayonnaise, and relish. Mm -hmm. They probably put a little garlic or something in it. But that's all it is. They put too much. I think they just put too much lettuce on this. It's like... A field of lettuce. Protein style, you think they just give you the burger, huh? Not the lettuce part of it. I don't know, but I'm just wrap it up in this little lettuce.
Yeah, I'm not a big, super big fan of in and out. It is good, but it's not like people pump it up. People pump in and up out like it's just the best thing going. No, it's not. It's all right. You got to eat that french fries quickly because they get cold in like five seconds. As soon as they give them to you and drive to them, just stick your hand in your face. Ooh, y'all are drooling. I ain't cutting that out either. I don't cut nothing out anyway. But as soon as they give them to you, just just stick your hand in the bag and start eating them. Because they're going to be cold by the time you get home, even if you live right down the street, like me. I can walk there. I can get there in seven minutes by walking. So about two minutes by driving. That's how close it is. And my fries is like stuck together. I don't know what it is. And these are like real potatoes. They use real potatoes. I thought potatoes like hold heat. Not these in and out ones. They good though. They good though. They good. They good though. They good though. Oh, this meal is courtesy of Miss Pinky. That's a gift card that she gave me for Christmas. I got one more left. I don't know where I'm gonna go with that one. So that, that other gift card, I can go to several different places. Which my favorite place is Olive Garden. That's one that's on there. I can go to the Olive Garden and get me some lasagna. Freaks, 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 freaks. Y'all remember I told y'all a couple of days my Christmas tree is still up? It's still up. Y'all, I, I go to work and I'm at work and I'll be like, when I get home, I'm going to do such and such. I'm going to do this. I'm gonna... It never happens. It never happens. But I do need to take that Christmas tree down. Maybe when London come home, she won't take it down. That's a wild guess. She ain't going to take it down. But maybe she will. Maybe she'll feel like doing something. Cause I'm tired of looking at it. I really am. Mm hmm. A big old tree. That thing is huge. Do you guys do false trees or the regular like trees from the tree thing, tree place? I stopped doing those trees because I like the noble firs. I like noble fir trees. Them trees cost about seventy dollars if you want like a six foot tree. I'm not giving the man seventy dollars every year. For a Christmas tree because I want my house to smell like Christmas. So what I did one year, I think this is my second false tree because I had one and it was skinnier and I didn't like it, that it was skinny. So I think I gave it to my sister. So I went after Christmas and I think my tree was probably like 200 and something dollars. But I got it for 75% off. Good little deal. And um, I love my tree. I really do. But London wants me to get a white tree, but it's not going to happen. She better spray some white paint on it. Some of that snow stuff. Because I'm not buying a white tree. It's not going to happen. Why are we talking about Christmas trees, huh? I don't know, y'all. Why do I talk about a lot of stuff that I talk about? I don't know why. She swallowed the fly. Perhaps she'll die. <laughs> y'all like that? Um, I want everybody to flood my inbox. On the Instagrams, tell me how to send an email to YouTube because I don't know how to do it. Like the emails that they send you, if you try to send something back and tell you, you can't send an email to that channel, I mean to that place or whatever. I ain't feeling it. I need to talk to them. Whoever is in charge, I need to talk to y'all because I got some questions and I need some answers. Y'all, I'm full. I'm full. Eat my protein. One time I went to um, in and out and I told them that I wanted my... Um, Let 
me stop. I told him that I wanted my, um, I'm really full. Maybe my stomach trunk, what I went to the gym. Y'all think so? No. But I told them I wanted my burger. I always say extra well done. Burn it if you have to. Did I bite into it and it was pink? I was pissed. And I wasn't going back over there. So I called the corporate number that's on the bottom of the receipt. They didn't even give me a receipt. And do you know that if you are dissatisfied with in and out, if you're dissatisfied with anybody's service, call the corporate number. But I called the corporate office and they actually sent me um coupons in the mail for free burgers and fries. It was only two because it was only me in London who ate it. My son doesn't like in and out. I don't know what's wrong with him, but he don't if it, well he only likes plain food. He eats like a cheeseburger from McDonald's with just bread, meat, and cheese. Nothing else. No. Well, no, he likes ketchup, but he don't want no onions on it. He will not eat it. If I cook spaghetti, he like he loves spaghetti. If I cook it and I put onions in it, he can tell. Even if I cut him up the smallest bit of onions, he be like, "Mom, you put onions in that." He won't eat it. So I cannot use the onions when cooking for that little boy. He, I bought a cheeseburger and forgot to tell him no onions. He wouldn't eat it because he couldn't. You know them onions are little and you can't pull them off. So he wouldn't eat the cheeseburger. My kids are weird. My kid, he's very weird. All he eats is pizza. Pizza, hot dogs, hamburgers. <coughs> spaghetti. He likes spaghetti. And tacos. <coughs> and y'all, the little boy, he's, he's 16. And he weighs about 65 pounds. I know nothing's wrong with him. That's the same thing the doctor thought that maybe I was at home starving him. He didn't want to eat. No, I just told the doctor he's a very picky eater. But he will, like, if I bought him a whole pizza, he will eat the whole pizza. He can get down and eat him. But I guess he's got very quick metabolism. I mean, very fast. His metabolism is fast because that little boy is bony. He is bones. Bones to the bone, bone, bone. So they took all these tests thinking that maybe he had tapeworms or he had, what else did they think? He was malnutritioned. They thought all type of stuff about this kid. I'm just like, no, he's a very picky eater. There's nothing wrong with him. Take all the tests you want to take. Come to my house and you'll see that we got food for him to eat. So there's nothing wrong with him like that. But they thought it was. I guess they thought I was neglecting the kid and he wasn't eating. His mama ain't feeding him. He hungry, that baby. Hungry, feed that baby. He wasn't hungry. He just, y'all about to go. I'm just rambling and rambling. Y'all probably say, we, you don't even talk about this little boy. So who is you talking about? His name is Azure. So I got Azure, I got a London, and I got a Taurus. All three of those. Yes, I do. But I'm about to go. So I will talk to you guys later on another video. Oh, oh. I got to do my challenge videos. They may be coming. I don't know when, but they don't come. I'm not looking forward to it. The makeup thing is all right, even though I don't really wear makeup. But that soda stuff, I'm not looking forward to that. I sure ain't. I'm not. <clears throat> Y'all, I feel like I got to. We're not going to talk about it. I'm about to go. Thank you guys for watching my video on my free in and out meal. Well, it wasn't free. Someone bought it for me. So this, this video is sponsored by... Miss Pinky. I'm gonna put her name across the screen. She don't have no YouTube channel. But when she in my comment my comments, her name is Narbeline in my comments. She say hi to her. Say thank you, Pinky, for giving Shell a um meal that she can come share with us. I'm about to go. I love you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share this video with every and anybody that you know. And don't forget to hit that little bell. wherever you want to hit it at, so that you will be notified of each and every time that I post a what? You got it, a video. Love you guys, bye. Mwah.